Dahl Scientific Advisor, day one on planet Pandora. I have been assigned to this sector by my superiors to find evidence of abandoned alien technology similar to that found by our competitor, the Atlas Company, in the ruins on Prometheus. Technology that many believe made them the superpower they are now. This kind of find seems astronomically improbable on a rock like this, but my benefactors believe in it enough to waste my considerable talents. I've only been here for three hours, and I already believe this planet will be the death of me. Scientists do not chase myths and legends. under a colleague of mine who was being devoured on top of me. His name was Carl. My emotions are deadened, and I grieve for none of them. In point of fact, the only emotion I felt was that of joy. I felt joy because his chair was always more comfortable than mine. I took his chair, and then I noticed the emissive glow on the rocks at the dig site. shower and tears for just under an hour. This is interesting, considering we haven't had water for days. I equate my ever-decreasing sanity with that of the population of my dig site. With the investigation of the symbols and glowing patterns at the site, we finally unearthed arguably certifiable proof of the existence of alien life having been here on Pandora. But this celebration was lonely, as I only have two colleagues left. And I'm not too fond of the fat girl, Shimei. I've been told that scientific discovery requires sacrifice, but I never understood what they meant until now. misery, 
as she choked on various fluids and bile. I hesitated because she was the last one alive, but it wasn't me. As she was choking and coughing and dying, I tried to enjoy the interaction, which I imagined to be a conversation, as I knew it was the last I would have for a while. I finally got around to smothering her so that I could continue my research. I could tell that she regretted the decision. The Skags have been waiting for this meal for a while. They will not go hungry tonight. Check me out! Oh, come on! Get down! <sighs> <sighs>
the notch on my whip. over here. Yeah. <sighs> 
thought about settling down? We could use someone like you around here. help me understand exactly what all this arid and text I've been attempting to decipher actually means. My mother has been dead for 15 years. She's never actually interested in science to begin with. I'm unsure if I'm quite to the point of no return, but my stubbornness, which I got from her in the first place, will keep me here putting up with her until I find exactly where the vault is, or until I drive myself so far off the edge I do not remember why I was doing this in the first place.
That must have hurt. For me? Yeah!
Ah, oh, that's just a flesh wound. You looking to get shot? <laughs>
shoot, please don't shoot, please don't shoot, please don't shoot, please, 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 please. Watching you, friend. Be careful. Others are starting to see their own opportunity. Ah. Uh. 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 